हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू माई चैनल एच डी ओर आयन वी आर स्टडिंग अकाउंटेंसी फॉर क्लास ट्वेल्थ फ्रॉम टी एस गेरेवाल्स टेक्स्ट बुक टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थ्री एडिशन अकाउंटिंग फॉर पार्टनरशिप फॉर्म्स चैप्टर वन अकाउंटिंग फॉर पार्टनरशिप फॉर्म्स फंडामेंटल्स एंड इन दिस वीडियो वी विल स्टडी मिनिमम अर्निंग्स गारंटीड बाई अ पार्टनर सो लेट अस सी सम क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम द टेक्सट बुक क्वेश्चन नंबर 94. थ्री चार्टर्ड अकाउंटेंट्स अभिजीत बलजीत एंड चरणजीत फॉर्म अ पार्टनरशिप प्रॉफिट्स बीइंग शेयर्ड इन द रेशियो ऑफ थ्री टू टू इज टू वन सब्जेक्ट टू द फॉलोइंग चरणजीत शेयर ऑफ प्रॉफिट गारंटीड टू बी नॉट लेस देन रुपीज फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड पर एन बलजीत गेव अ गारंटी टू द इफेक्ट दैट ग्रॉस फी अर्न बाई हिम फॉर द फॉर्म शेल बी इक्वल टू हिज एवरेज ग्रॉस फी of the preceding 5 years when he was carrying on profession alone which on an average worked out works out at rupees 25000 the profit for the first year of the partnership is rupees 75000 the gross fee earned by baljit for the firm is rupees 16000 you are required to show profit and loss appropriation account after giving effect to the above now in this question there are two types of guarantees in the question first is that a, a firm has given guarantee of rupees 15000 to the partner charanjit that he will be earning not less than rupees 15000 per annum and the second guarantee is is a guarantee which a partner baljit is giving to the firm that he will in every in in whatever situation he will be able to generate a profit of rupees 25000 for the firm as he was earning before he joined the partnership firm but by mistake or due to some reason baljit could only contribute rupees 16000 so here also we find that uh, baljit is unable to generate that much of profit as he guaranteed to the firm and the other case charanjit should get rupees 15000 at least and out of profit of rupees 75000 we will have to check whether he is getting rupees 15000 or not so both the guarantees we have to do this in this question let us see the solution for this solution 94 we will see in profit and loss appropriation account first we will write net profit net profit earned by the firm is rupees 75000 but there is a guarantee which one of the partner has given to the firm is who is that partner baljit baljit promised that he will earn 25000 rupees for the firm but unfortunately he could only contribute 16000 to the firm fine and because it is a guarantee which baljit has given to the firm as a result the firm will take the firm will take full 25000 from baljit so baljit will contribute here baljit he promised rupees 25000 to the firm but could manage to earn only rupees 16000 so remaining 9000 will be contributed from baljit now the net profit of the firm is rupees 84000 because this is also one of the guarantee which the partner has given to the firm now this 84000 will be distributed to the partners profit in their profit sharing ratio which is 3 is to 2 is to 1 when we break this to partners abhijit baljit and charanjit we get rupees 42000 rupees 28000 and rupees 14000 but here one more guarantee is there to charanjit that the firm has promised him at least 15000 rupees but here it is less than 15000 1000 rupees is deficient here so that will be contributed by the other two partners that is baljit and abhijit in their profit sharing ratio which is 3 is to 2 so this deficiency of rupees 
will be borne by Abhijit and Baljit in their profit sharing ratio which is 3 is to 2. When you break for rupees 1000 in 3 is to 2, Abhijit will contribute rupees 600 and Baljit will contribute rupees 400. So we will deduct 600 rupees from Baljit and 400 rupees from 600 rupees from Abhijit and 400 rupees from Baljit and give this to Charanjit rupees 1000. Fine. Now, how much did they get? It is 41,400 for the first partner, then 27,600 for the second partner and the guaranteed amount rupees 15,000 for Charanjit. This way entire 84,000 rupees will be distributed to the partners. So this way the problem is to be solved. Now let us see question number 95. Zen, Sam and Tim are partners in a firm. For the year ended 31st March 2022, the profit of the firm rupees 1 lakh 20,000. Now it is it is reading 12 lakh but you have to correct it. It has to be 1 lakh 20,000 was distributed equally among them without giving effect to the following terms of the partnership deed. Sam's guarantee, Sam's guarantee to the firm that the firm would earn a profit of at least Rs. 1,35,000. Any shortfall in these, in these profits would meet, would met by him. Profits to be shared in the ratio of 2 is to 2 is to 1. You are required to pass the necessary journal entries to rectify the error in accounting. Now here, you see Sam is guaranteeing that the firm will earn a profit of Rs. 1,35,000 which the firm has not earned that is 1,20,000 only so the difference in the amount will be met by Sam first thing second thing is that profit was supposed to be distributed in the ratio 2 is to 2 is to 1 which the firm by mistake has given them equally and that also 1,20,000 was given to them equally which was not supposed to be fine so we need to correct this we have to pass journal entries for this so first we will reverse the profit and then we will take money from uh, means the difference money from Sam and then the full net profit will be given to the partners in correct profit profit sharing ratio. Let us see the solution. Solution 95. First we will reverse the profit of rupees 1,20,000 which was wrongly distributed in uh, 1 is to 1 is to 1 ratio. Fine. So partner's capital account will be debited and reduced. So Zen's capital account debited. Sam also debited. And Tim also debited. To profit and loss appropriation account. This profit and loss appropriation account is also called by name profit and loss adjustment account. So one should not get confused because in the answer it is given profit and loss adjustment account which is nothing but profit and loss appropriation account. Now it was distributed by mistake equally to the partners. So we have taken that money back from them being profit reversed. In which ratio it was given? In the same ratio, the firm took the money back. After this, Sam's guarantee will be attended here. Now, Sam's capital account will be debited because Sam promised that the firm will earn a net profit of Rs. 1,35,000. 1,35,000. But firm could only make Rs. 1,20,000. So, 15,000 we will recover from we will take from Sam and it will be brought to profit and loss appropriation account. So 
so because he guaranteed 135000 and therefore 15000 which was short was recovered from sam now you can see here that in profit and loss appropriation account credit side there is a profit of rupees 120000 and rupees 15000 you add this you get 135000 which is the uh, promised amount and now this 135000 net profit will be given to all the three partners in their correct profit sharing ratio so profit and loss appropriation account debited to zen to partner sam and to tin and their correct profit sharing ratio is 2 is to 2 is to 1 so this to 135000 is debited now profit and loss appropriation account is uh, closed with the equal amount and it will be distributed in the ratio 2 is to 2 is to 1 the amounts are rupees 54000 rupees 54000 and rupees 27000 being profit to partners in profit sharing ratio so this this is how the entries are to be made so this was the last question on in this chapter chapter number 1 and i hope that you have got all the concepts very clear because this particular chapter is very important to understand the entire partnership partnership portion of the syllabus these these informations which we have studied in first chapter will be required in admission retirement death and dissolution of a firm which is the syllabus of class 12 and i suggest you that you have to read the question comprehend the question very well understand the question and develop a develop a habit of remembering the details and information of the question till you have finished the answer that will be very much helpful that will reduce your wastage of time and the second thing is that one should be very smart in making calculations correct and smart calculations you have to make you have to improve your arithmetic calculations you have to be correct otherwise you will lose marks which will uh, means means you will regret it later that you didn't do well in case you are having any doubt please put it in the comment section thank you so much for liking subscribing and sharing this channel